Well, the city of Greenville is taking continued measures to curb the spread of COVID-19 and they're creating, they're getting, I should say, creative when it comes to high touch spaces in the city. That's what they're saying. 7 News' Ayla Farone has the details. Benches like this one are disappearing all across the city of Greenville. Leaders tell us it is all in an effort to stop gatherings amid the pandemic. High trafficked areas like quarters and by the Reedy River are seeing some changes. We had a bench here and there was one down here as well. Steve Boone owns trios on Main Street and says the benches near his business were moved about six months ago. Our corners may be a little more high profile and they started with us. The city removed additional benches on the corner of McBee and also under this bridge more recently. In the places where we see people tending to kind of gather together, want to sit, want to to have community. We're trying to take some of those away strategically. Beth Brotherton with the city says it's all in an effort to curb the spread of coronavirus. Benches are really hard to keep clean and hard to keep safe. Um, with a lot of people touching them and, and a lot of people sitting down. She says City Works sanitizes and power washes the benches, but the ones that were removed couldn't get cleaned often enough. Boone says the removal of the benches near Trio helps with more than just COVID. If people are dying and they want to be left alone, and sometimes these guys would come up, ask for money, ask for food and that kind of stuff. But he says removing certain benches only moves the problem elsewhere. People are going to find somewhere to sit. And, and I mean, a lot of people do come downtown just to kind of hang out. Brotherton says the city is finding solutions there too. We work closely with our community partners to make sure that our homeless community has a safer place to sleep. Meanwhile, she wants to remind those enjoying downtown to maintain safe distances. Just recognizing that the city is taking all the precautions we can for COVID safety and hoping that our citizens will will help us in that respect. City leaders say the benches that have been removed may eventually be put back, but right now they will remain in storage. In Greenville, Ela Farone, 7 News.